guys good morning welcome to new video and it is sunday the 23rd of june yeah and it's a uh, bit rainy i'll uh, just pan my camera around as you can see yeah so it's uh, been a bit wet overnight But we are going to go for a little bit of a walk today. I mean, hopefully it stays quite dry. So I'm uh, currently charging my hopes up for the uh, GoPro. So I'll be using the GoPro a bit later on. Uh. Yeah, we're going to walk a couple of uh, side streets, really. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to have a walk up towards Stanley Parkway. And then, uh, got through towards Blackfield Town Centre so I'll take you guys with me for a walk yeah I hope everyone's doing alright hope everyone's having a uh, good weekend so far most importantly hope everyone's enjoying the football matches if you are drop a comment down below let me know what you think to the uh, results so far up to date and yeah let me know how your weekend is and I just had my first encounter with uh, a dog walker just enjoying the uh, Sunday walk through his dog I'm using the uh, Oswald Pocket 2 at the moment. So I've got my uh, microphone on my body at the moment. Hopefully it doesn't rain. Because, uh, yeah, this camera's not exactly waterproof. Whereas my uh, Accent GoPro is waterproof. But I don't mind using this camera occasionally from time to time. So I do kind of miss, miss, I do kind of miss using it. So it's a nice small little camera. I mean, you can go out there, vlog, or film or whatever. And it's not like a big camera in front of you. GoPro's a little bit more bigger. But it packs a punch. You get more you get more battery life. It's weatherproof. So you can go out no matter what the weather. Whereas the Osborne Pocket, you need to uh, be careful what weather's gone by. Like. If it starts raining, it's game over. But apart from that, it's not too bad. It's good quality at 4K. So, uh, yeah, there's not much I can really ask for. Plus it's got a uh, external microphone. So the audio quality is probably a bit better off than the GoPro. And it's really clammy today, you know. It's really quiet. Yeah, i got a car coming at the moment. But apart from that,
few allotments down there. And normally I'd uh, say, oh yeah, I'm going to go and get myself a drink, but it wasn't long ago since I had some uh, cereal. So not that right moment, thankfully. Even though it really is quite warm. Yeah, we've got a price point to the shop just on the corner coming up. That is uh, opposite the top of Watts Road. You got Watts Road Junction just here coming up, just on the uh, left hand side. And here we've got the Price Wise convenience store. Yeah, it's not too bad in there to be honest. Been in there maybe once or twice. But as Max says, onwards, my friends. And you got uh, Big Bean M's just right up there. A Big Bean M store. Yeah, well, all the convenience stores are open and everything, but uh, like big stores like that, they don't open until 10 o'clock on a Sunday. I think they should probably scrap the uh, Sunday training hours. I don't think any other country does it. Or do they? Let me know in the comments down below. And correct me if needs be. Oh, does anybody fancy a pot of land for sale? Commercial. Probably do a uh, decent investment on here. I'd say a garage, but there's plenty of garages about. And there's a uh, Empire garage just over here on the corner, so uh, yeah, that might be that one out of the question. But you can probably make some, you can probably put like a little store there or something, I don't know. Or mini market. Yeah, we'll uh, carry on further up here. Yeah, so I've got that Empire garage just here. Quite a few cars, but uh, some of them are quite a bit old. That looks alright for that. Those that people carry. Yeah, I'll tell you something, I'm still terrible with road names. Yeah, I remember once actually coming to uh, have a look at a house up this way. I'm trying not to go for it because uh, well, there was parking I think at the rear and I could have made the uh, back garden into a driveway if I wanted to but I was a bit like nah.
Yeah, I've just seen sand. This car park's getting resurfaced. To be honest, it doesn't look anything longer. It. So, yeah. It is what it is, I suppose. Because they're going to resurface, and that's what resurface. If they want to wash the cash, then they can. Talk about splashing the cash. There's more shops just up here. That would be quite nice to walk on Sunday. It's amazing how far you can actually go. That one's called Arnold's Convenience Store, just there across the road. Got a pub head just coming up called Lane Ends. Sunday quiz night. Win a twenty-five pound drinks voucher. Double your money answer one question to one question to win twenty-five quid free entry. Answer two questions to win fifty quid every Saturday night. And we've got a lovely seating area right here. Where you can come outside and enjoy a few drinks and do if you got children with you. There's always a centre bit, I suppose. Oh, it does look a bit like that. Yeah, it looks nice. Here we've got PDSA, Pet Hospital. But one thing which. Uh, was deluded to me a while ago is that PDSA they'll only look at your dog if you're on dole if you're willing to pay they won't even see for you which I think is a bit wrong got a big through here that's nice on the outside. And so we'll uh, carry on up here. Yeah, we're just coming up towards uh, what I like to call Star Junction around here. That's full side lane that would just come down. And we're now going to cross over. Into here. Oh, the lights are green. Wow. How good is that? Well, that's quite cool. Good timing. But unfortunately, now I need to wait for a couple of cars. And normally I'd walk all the way from down there. Yeah, we're supposed to be getting a uh, heat wave of about 30 degrees over the next week.
it's probably starting to try and come in now. Hope not, because it'll be uncomfortable to sleep at night. But saying that would be nice, because I'll be out and about in a van. Doing deliveries to all those for whack hair car and full whack. Yeah, man, I got it. It's really quiet on the road, and I nearly went over on my ankle. It's all here, nine o'clock. So it's really, really quiet. Got a couple of cars about and stuff. Got a couple of people out and about on foot that I've noticed. Got a commercial props ahead to that. I'm sure it used to be some bad place at one point. Yeah, but anyway, I'm going to uh, knock off here and go and grab myself a drink. So I'll be with you guys in just a second. Mondo. Yeah, so I decided to go and get myself a drink, and out of all the drinks, look what I got. Yeah, bubble gum, M millions, explosive energy drink. So, I think I'll uh, crack the can open and let you guys know what I think to it. So, bottoms up. Ooh, that's really nice actually. Yeah, don't go allowing your kids to drink this because it's a uh, high caffeine energy drink. And uh, millions is normally a kid's drink. So we're just near uh, Martin Institute here, Fam Family Fun Day, not sure if that's been going on that. We've got Aldi just over there, with Home Bargains going past. Some great advertising there for Home Bargains, <laughs> oh my god. That was a brilliant shot. We've got HSBC Bank in there. Apparently they've gone there. Uh, they've got rid of stuff. Well, I think they've still got stuff there, but I think they've I think they're trying to make it more like a do-it-yourself type of thing. 
give it to yourself all the time, but to do it if you want us to do it ourselves. Not a lot of people are going to put the camera on blank for them. Anyway, we're going to try and cross this road here in one piece. Let's see if we can do it. I want to get all the way over there. Well, I told you I'd be able to do it. Yeah, I'm across the road now. But my God, what a lot this is. Got Uranix over there, which is an appliance Applying spares direct. Oh right, yeah, so I'm going to leave the video there. I'm going to carry on with my drink. Then I'll see you all in my next video where I'll be walking around Stanley Park. So uh yeah I'll catch you all in a bit. And of course if you enjoyed that video, hit like button, hit subscribe, don't forget to ding on that notification bell. And yeah, I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace out. Take care.